Welcome back, lassie. I haven't written the script for my next movie yet, so we're not recording. I'll call for you when the script is ready. Did you know that having a pet helps improve self-confidence and relieve stress? Did you also know that pets can have pets? It is true. Unfortunately, us express owls are not allowed to have pets. It is a sacrifice we must make in the name of hooting. But if you had a pet, what do you think the name of your pet's childhood pet would be? is certainly an interesting name for a pet, even for a pet's pet. Have you noticed all these crows around the place? They keep asking for personal details, and I never know what to answer. would murder one of the express owls. And I can't believe even more that it's your uncle's sister. What do you have to say for yourself? Oh, 
Ooh, you're giving me the quiet treatment, eh? That's what a murderer would do. Leave this case to us. We're Kaw, the Crow Agent Watch. We've been monitoring everyone on this train since the last station. We'll be searching the entire train for evidence. No one is allowed to go outside of this wagon. What? I can't even walk around in my own train! Oh, how dare ya! Once the clock hits midnight, we'll get off at the station with the murderer in cuffs. Stay here while we investigate further. Those core picnics can't tell me what to do. I bet they committed the murder and are destroying all the evidence.
Eva. Mm -hmm. Has gotten itself in an unusual situation. It's hanging out on a thin rope for dear life, just above the wood cutting machine. What an odd coincidence. What are you going to do? Save it from becoming sawdust? Or figure out who the murderer is?
Uh, we couldn't find any conclusive evidence. We have no idea who murdered this owl. What? So you've done pickle to solve the case? Who's the murderer? Which one are you dead at? It all makes sense! You saw the Express Owl all by himself. A lonely victim in your master scheme. With a hatred for society and its rapidly increasing progress of transportation, you strike down the first passenger you saw! His body laid like a mannequin with blood Spilling everywhere, and the smell! It woke your inner demons! Then you tore off his limbs and ate them one by one, like an animal lusting for blood! That's how it happened, wasn't it? You murdered that owl in cold blood! Actually, I'm fine. She just stuck this fake rubber knife on me and told me to play dead. But still, you've gone too far this time, detective. You're going to the doghouse. Well, thanks for solving the murder, lassie. Not only did you reveal the murderer, you also revealed that the victim was never harmed. And you gave us intense footage for the movie. Oh. You think I'd let a murder happen on my Owl Express? Oh, think again. That was all just a setup for my newest Owl Express movie. Murder on the Owl Express. Oh, you think DJ Picnic will make a movie that's even remotely as good? Ha! I think not. Here, take this thingamajig and get out of here. <laughs> Welcome to the first day of shooting, darling. We need to transform you into the biggest movie star the bird world has ever seen. You need to become a diva. That's why I've called for a press conference here on our moon set. You need to get out there in front of the cameras and electrify the public, darling. Get them really up and going for your movies. Once you've got them going crazy, come back here and we'll show off our new prop. That's right. We'll unveil our new movie prop to the masses. Hello?
darling. Looks like it's endorsement time. All you penguins out there know my name, DJ Grooves. And I'm telling you, this young girl here is the next hot thing, guaranteed. Watch as she beats these hard-boiled card players at their own game on her first try. This game is easy to understand, darling. You just guess which number of cards the other player is holding from one to ten. Which card do you think he's holding, darling? <laughs> Wow, fantastic, incredible! The answer is indeed three! Folks at home, you have just witnessed the stunning intuition of a true star! Make sure you join our fan club, DJ Grooves, out! Looks like it's endorsement time. Now, darling, I have to mention this. Cooking show hosts have a terrible track record of getting angry and swearing on screen. Try not to use the P word, okay? Don't say P-E-C-K. The conductor is old-fashioned. He throws that word around a lot. It'll get him in trouble someday. Until then, let's keep our show clean. Hello, viewers! Even the biggest celebrities have to eat. And I've got with me the biggest celebrity of them all! Now tell us, darling, what kind of condiments do you like on your tuna sandwiches? <laughs> darling! I mean, I mean, fellow viewers, look at the mouth on this young girl. She's really something. Now shoot, get out of this endorsement as soon as you can before the old ones watching TV notice what just happened. The audience is going crazy, darling. Come over here and show off our new stunner. Our new prop!
call, darling? Looks like it's endorsement time. All you penguins out there know my name, DJ Grooves. And I'm telling you, this young girl here is the next hot thing. Look at how street smart this diva is. She's standing in this sinister alleyway right next to some potential wrongdoers. Danger is her middle name, and she's not afraid to step outside of her comfort zone. Make sure you join her fan club, DJ Grooves. Out. She'll climb up this statue and rescue the poor puppy that has gotten stuck! Right, darling? Ah! Look at that! She helped the puppy down safe and sound! Too bad it ran off and definitely didn't break into multiple pieces. This is truly a diva I can get behind. Let it be known that this little girl is all about animals. Make sure you join her fan club, DJ Groove. Out. Again, my arch nemesis. What? You don't remember me? How rude. It's me, boss of the mafia. Remember? You blew me up in our little indiscretion, and your young friend captured my remains in this jar. I'm without a body. I should be furious, but it is okay. The past is the past, and I'll accept your carcass as an apology. 
You won't hand it over? Such nerve on such a small child. If I had hands, I would slap you. I'll just buy a new body then. There has to be some poor soul out there who would be willing to trade his corpse for money. I may not look like it right now, but I'm well-traveled. I know the whereabouts of all the secrets on this planet. Buy my map badge, and I will show you where you can find relics that will make you rich.
Mafia see girl in red. Girl say Mafia bad and try attack, but Mafia throw her into ocean. Mafia laugh at angry wet girl.
Please, disregard my twitchy behavior.
Look at mess. This is terrible. Someone turn on all faucets in Mafia Town. Same faucets that control the town volcano. Was it you, child? No? Mafia think he saw a little girl turn on all faucets. Little hat kid, can you save Mafia Town by turning off if you close all? Maybe water start flowing again.
doorway. Mafia watching shows. High interest in plot <laughs> Bye. 
did it! Small child saved Mafia Town! Now Mafia no longer need to eat lava for breakfast! Amazing! Please, take this as trophy! You are truly the hero of Mafia Town!
In. We're getting ready to shoot the biggest action movie in bird history! The movie is gonna be the bomb! <laughs> and I, I mean bomb in the good way, Picnic. Listen up, I have some bad news. That lever you just pulled, uh, it starts the train self-destruct sequence, and that ain't no joke. It'll blow up. I need a movie with some real intense action. So that's what we're gonna do. The train's gonna blow in a few minutes. But you can save us all, lassie. Get to the switch at the front of the train to turn it off. And you better make it in time, all right? I don't care about the owls or yourself, but you don't dare blow up me train for real. It's my baby. The cameras are gonna be rolling, lassie. You hurry now, go over and out.
it! And in time! Oh, <laughs> look at all this raw footage we got! Look at how you, 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 you're running for dear life! <laughs> oh, what? We did it in the name of cinematography! And to beat that no good DJ Cruz. All right, here, take one of these, uh, thingamajigs you like. You deserve it. What do you think the name of your pet's childhood pet? <laughs>
I don't know much about the goats up here. If you get in their way, they uh, tend to be a bit pushy. <laughs> Seems weird about them to me. Blow those 